Hi guys, Digital Demon here again and welcome back to the bunker. In the last episode we went down even further into the depths of the bunker into level 5 because we found out the entire place is pretty much rife with radiation. Oh, what's this? A hatch. Yeah. Let's uh, investigate the hatch, shall we? We haven't got a tool for it. Presumably we'll need a tool. No, your fingers will do apparently. Or maybe they won't. No, you're going to need something better than that, John. So I presume that's what we're going to find through the door. Yes, this, this person is attacking people with an axe. In his memory. Obviously, we and our mother survive. Oh, oh. Help me, John. I'm ready on them this time. His last one. No spoilers if you haven't seen it, but we 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 weren't as prepared as we should be. I think we're still supposed to believe that's Bishop, but I'm not. I'm not convinced. Right. So the thing for it is just there, which I can't interact with. Can I just go to the door? Excuse me. No, I can just. There's no point. Should we try the door anyway, just for, for just for giggles? No, it's not having any of it. So I was actually on the right sort of uh, the right sort of path at the beginning already. Yeah. Okay. You can stop trying now, John. It's clearly not going to work. It's all right. There's a tool there. There's a tool right at the side of you. If you look to the left right now, you'll be able to see it. Pick me, pick me, it seems to say. There, just this thing here. Well, she won't be here now. A torch. A to That's not quite the tool I was expecting, but a torch will do. A torch is handy. Anything else, or? No? Apparently, what? Well, where's the, where's the thing, then? Where is the thing... Oh, is that it here? Oh, we're using a friend. Oh no. That's mother, isn't it? We haven't been looking out for friends. I just realised. Have we missed any? Oh, we probably have missed some. Come on! They're getting harder, I'm sure they're getting harder. More pressing, more tap 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 is required. Have we missed any friends? I haven't been looking. Oh no. I didn't see anything on the floor here to be fair. Yeah, we've got a torch, it's fine. Well, I say it's fine. No one wants to go down to the deep dark depths. There's no friends on the floor around here. Don't look like it. I guess we're going down. We've got the torch. Down we go. Into, no doubt, the sewer level. Sewer level? That's what you get in every good horror game, isn't it? Some sort of sewer level? Maybe. 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 That was loud. Oh, we left it behind. That's bad omen. Yes. Definitely like sewer or pipes or something. A lot of cable is cables down here. So where we're we gonna end up. Come on, John. I hear some of those scary noises again. He's not doing badly for someone with one arm. Where are we? Are we looking from his point of view again? No? Or is that just setting up where we actually are? I thought we were going to have another flashback there. So it's over there. Is that a friend? No? Oh, what's this? 
Yeah, that's well and truly closed. Anything else, or is it just that? Appears to be just that. Okay, let's go and have a look. Oh, we now now comes the flashback. Has this guy with the axe got a motivation yet? Ah, the keys. Always useful. Oh, it is Bishop. Um. Looking for the key. Why would I give you a way out, Margaret? You and the little rat. I'm not going to leave. I thought that was a bit too predictable, to be honest. You're not going anywhere. We're all going to die down here. John, no! No! <laughs> Um, yeah. Up. Oh. Well, we know she survives. Well, she survives up until the start of the game, at least. Kick him. Hit him with something. Hit him with the axe. Or the gun. When did he upgrade from an axe to a gun? Is it an upgrade? It's okay. No one can hurt us now. Hmm. So this is why those two survived, but... I did it. I killed him. Right. So we really the killer all along? To be fair, Bishop seems like a bad man. And where's the body? Did we kill him? Or is he going to make a triumphant return? As they tend to in horror games. I should shut up really. This is quite a suspenseful moment. Right. Okay, so what have we got over here? Another. So we have a sign. What's the sign say? Soon this place will be full of radiation. So, yeah, we are actually just gunning for the exit. Because we've knackered it, basically. Oh, what was that? Blood. Okay, pleasant. Does that mean that's where the uh that's where he's gonna be? Oh that means he's crawled why am I checking this? That means he's crawled there when he's been shot. That's gone stale, he's gonna be beh right behind here. I clearly need a code, John. I haven't got a code actually, have I? Oh, bloody buttons. Oh, we did it. Okay. It's quite grim, really. Four buttons. It's all right, John. It's over. We're safe here. And that's all that matters. As long as I'm here, I'll look after you. Nothing can hurt us now. Yes, Molly. I love you, John. Right. So we just need to look for the bloody buttons. Wait. I don't know the code. Well, it's clearly here, so that it's going to be like where they're faded. So it's clearly what three, seven, eight. But what's the last one? Six? No. That's doubly bloody, so is it, could it be three again? There's blood on the keypad. Yeah. What's the code? Three, seven, eight. I'm going to say six. That looks a tiny bit bloody. 
Yep, that's it. <laughs> We're going to another loading screen, Awakenings. Oh, this one's a slow loading. Very slow loading. Um. Oh, there we go. <laughs> Just worrying it was it crashed there. Time to get your torch out, John. That's a cool shot. I like that. Very atmospheric. I'm still thinking Bishop's still alive. How he survived so long, we don't know. Okay, something's triggering off inside his brain. So everyone was choking. And dying except for where I was. And John's mum. Does he think we've done it? Have we done it? That. Oh. Uh. This isn't good. If there's multiple bodies in here, someone could have survived. Cannibalism and all that. They're all down here. So who put them all down here? Was it our mum? Was it us? Or is Bishop still alive? So many questions! I was just... Is, are you waiting for me to do something? You keep going to the same thing over and over again. Ah! Oh! Oh! oh. Okay. Well that was cool. So it's like he's haunted by the memories of the people. Very clever camera work. Why that one? Oh, oh. Well, what did you think you were going to achieve? Anything else? Over there. Hmm. Are you going to shine your light and there's going to be a face? Here's something. Oh. 
keys and just go. Ah. Uh, Blindsided by fear, terror, and hallucinations. Cold storage. Just go, John. Just go. Soundtrack's very uncomfortable right now. Yeah, guess we're going that way. Still haven't seen any friends, so I'm assuming we've missed three somewhere. It'd be very unlikely that we find them at this point, I would think. Don't drop your torch. What's down there? Bottomless drop. No. Oh, don't burn your other hand. Caution hot surface. It says right there. When you reach level five, find the ventilation hatch. Look for the hot pipe, but make sure it's the one with the warning label, John. Then open the top. Be careful. And you run back to me as fast as you can. As fast as you can, John. Promise me. I promise. You've got this. You understand. You'll remember. Good boy. Be careful. Did we poison everyone then? Well, Mum poisoned everyone, but got us to do the dirty work. And now we now playing this past John. My hot pipes. My hot pipe. My hot pipe. My hot pipe. I know I'm being quiet guys, but this is shaping up to be quite interesting. Breathe it in, John. So, but my instinct would just be smell it, see what it smells like. So, open it and just leave it. And then we get. As that heats up, it releases a chemical. So it goes into the air filtration unit. Yeah, and then we go to John running to his mum. But why? Why? So all Bishop was trying to do was stop us from killing his people, but why... Why did we kill his people? And had we blocked it out? So his memories are coming back now? The realisation of what he's done? Oh, my God. 
Oh god, um, any of them? Let's try the red one in the middle. No? Yes? That was a good guess, wasn't it? Or did they all work, maybe? And it just is a different ending? I'm assuming we're entering the end game territory. It doesn't seem like a particularly long game. And that's the way out, is it? Which he's never been. Well, he's never been out of his room. Well, he's never been out of the bunker, certainly. He has been out of his rooms. He's not supposed to have been. Allegedly. John. Yep, okay, up we go. I don't know where I've missed the uh, his friends. The last three friends. Well, they've been somewhere quite obvious. I'm sure someone will point out at some point. Escape. But it's probably not safe up there either. Think about it, where does the radiation come from? We're gone. So if there's no coming back really if we're sort of hallucinating that much. Yeah, these are definitely getting harder. Come on. Keep moving. Keep moving. Do what the mysterious voice said. Oh. Who's got us? Has a hallucination got us? Oh, didn't get that. What? Oh. What? So I just... Because I didn't press it in time. Well, it's still the red key. Doesn't give me an option to change the key. I clearly have to be faster. It's been less forgiving. Look at the state of his shirt. And the shoes, yeah, are still quite clean. Again, noticing the important things in life. Right, we're ready with the tappy tappies now. Right, go. And I'm ready for the tappy tappies. I have to keep going. Yes, John, you have to keep going, but. There was no explanation why a, a hallucination or a memory, unless someone is still alive. That's the, that's the whole thing. So many questions at this point. Where's the tappy tappy? There it is. There. Ah, too fast. Okay, that didn't seem to do any any difference either way. Right, 
I managed to do that one before though, it's the next one that I failed on. And that was about down here-ish. I'm ready. No, you're not real. Keep telling yourself that. So it can't stop you. Very atmospheric, very, very dramatic. Aha! No! Hit it! Hit it! I didn't hit it. Damn it! Right, I'll see you back there. Right, there we go. <laughs> That's sorted. Don't know why that one gave me so much trouble. As soon as I moved to reposition myself, though, it was fine. I think it was I was slightly ex, uh, extended. I'm, I'm making excuses. Right, I'm ready with another one just in case. So we're going all the way to the surface now. It's getting brighter. Daylight. It's like the first scene in Fallout. Fallout 3. You have to, John. You can't leave me, John. Stay with me. You promised a long year. Everything I did, I did for you. Don't listen to her, John. Stay or leave. Leave. She seems quite cold and calculated. So there is at least two optional endings. My only worry is it's not been the full 20 years, I don't think. There's grass. Leave. Yeah, breathe. Back where we started. I think that's it. The bunker. I enjoyed that. Adam Brown's brilliant in it. <laughs> Alan Plenderleaf. Hey, that was very good. I enjoyed that. It was um, quite short. But I suppose if, if you're working as an indie company, like an indie game, with quite a named actor, and I suppose quite a named voice actor as well. That's where the budget's gone. But the game itself, it was brilliantly filmed. Bryn. Editor Bryn. Like Cher, doesn't need a last name. Uh, yeah, that was good. The, the music was fantastic, building into sort of the whole atmosphere. It was just about a boy and his mother. And then his quest to survive. Now it'll be interesting seeing what Splendy Games, this is very good. I enjoyed this. This was very good. Developed by Wales Interactive. 
both both companies very good I enjoyed this thoroughly and I look forward to seeing what you guys have to offer in the future he casts John Adam Brown Margaret Sarah Green Commissioner Bishop Graham Fox Jerome St John Blake Miles Ruffley Richard Henders Rachel R Habib Amber Doyle and Simon Sparks who was the producer I noticed and there's some supporting cast as well very good no I, I thoroughly enjoyed that um, it's well worth picking up it is a short game but it looks like there might be multiple endings if there is multiple endings I might tag them on the end um, but then again why go out buy the game play it yourself see how your ending is different to mine see if you can find all your friends because I only found six of them and had to leave one behind it seems so that leads to the question where, where were the three that I missed but then again at one point I, I did stop looking for them not intentionally just it was a case that there were, there, it wasn't the forward of my mind the cinematography in it was brilliant as well I have to say it was um, each image was beautifully shot and I think it Am I right in thinking I read somewhere that it was filmed in a real bunker? I could be making that up, but I'm sure I did hear that somewhere. Now, I thoroughly enjoyed well, excellent storytelling and splendid games. I look forward to whatever you produce next. And I've got to check out more of what uh, Adam Brown's done, because he's, he's a brilliant actor, actually. And I know that, that sounds awful, so I, but he was like the comic relief in The Hobbit, and that's the only thing I've known him in. But on this, it was dramatic, it was very well done. Uh, it'd be interesting to see what else he's been in. Oh, the music. The music's really good. That's it, last chance films. Dom Shovelton was the guy who did the music. I believe you can get his soundtrack as well. He's like a composer. Very good. The Bunk Productions Limited. And that's it guys, that was The Bunker. I strongly urge you to get this game, see what other endings that you might come across. But in the meantime, I was the Digital Demon, this was The Bunker, and I'll see you guys in the next video. Thank you so much for watching. Catch you later, bye!